staff, parents, and students arrived at Escondido High School today for the first day of classes. Jaslyn Mendez is a senior this year. I'm hoping that we can all just go back to sports and school and having a, just a normal teenage life for my last year here. She has played volleyball since her freshman year and is eager to play again. Super excited. Just, I'm so ready to go back to everything. Gabriela Pastor is a junior this year. She said COVID doesn't make her as nervous anymore because she got vaccinated. Um, to be honest, like COVID is kind of scary, but not as much. But like, I'm very excited to see my friends and like hang out with them. But like, I don't want to hang out with them so much because I don't want to get COVID. The Escondido Union High School District sent out this return to campus guide. It goes over health and safety protocols, COVID screenings and exposure, as well as supportive services for students. Escondido Union High Schools will follow the county's guidelines if any COVID exposures come up. Cesar Perez walked his daughter to school on the first day. I feel happy that she is back. I feel that with online classes, she didn't learn as much. He just hopes students will take the proper precautions and wear their face masks. I think the school will take the proper precautions and I feel confident that they will know how to handle this situation. And just like that, it's the first day of classes for Escondido Union High School students. And out of all the students and parents that we spoke to today, no one really knew of anyone that made the choice to stay home for online classes. In Escondido, Tanya Thorne, KPBS News.